Okay, how are you doing today? We're going to be looking at some CSV files, which are files that are separated by a certain value, and we're going to, normally it's commas. It uh, doesn't have to be, though. But let's uh, cat out a file I have here created. It's just a plain text file with three columns separated by commas. We've got a first name, last name, and then a state that the person would be from. Um, so, we're counting out the file and it's in order there. Now, uh, we also know that if we do snort, <laughs> sort uh, my file, it's going to do it alphabetically by the first, you know, alphabetically for the entire line. So in theory, so we're saying basically uh, by the first column here, we got H, J, K. Um, but let's say we wanted to sort it alphabetically uh, by, let's say, the last name. Well, we can easily use the sort command to do that as well. What we're going to do is we're going to say dash t, and then we're going to give it a value, and that value is going to be our, our separator, our delimiter, which in this case is a comma. And then we're going to say what uh, field or column we want with dash k. I don't know why it's k. Um, and I'll say two, because our we want to sort it alphabetically by um, the last name, which is our second column here. And if we hit enter, you can see now it's alphabetically J, O, O, and V. And you can do the same thing for the third column. So now they're alphabetical by the state that they're from. So that is a quick and easy way to display information sorted by a particular column. Uh, now, I do want to mention that that is not modifying the original file. If we cat out that file, you can see it's still the original file, um, which just happens to be the, the correct order for alphabetical by the third column. But um, that is just displaying it. Now, obviously, if you wanted to uh, redirect it into a new file, you can do that, new.csv, and uh, we'll sort it by the second column here. So now if we cut out the new file, you can see it's sorted by alphabetically by the last name. So that was a quick tip for today for today's Terminal Tuesday Bash video. Uh, I'll probably have one or two more coming at you today. Uh, and I just wanted to give you that little quick tip. So I thank you for watching, and I hope that you have a great day. Please visit filmsbychris.com. That's Chris with a K. There's a link in the description, as well as to our Facebook fan page. You can head over there and give us a like, and I post extra information over there every once in a while. So thank you for watching, and I hope that you have a great day.